In this tutorial, I'm going to show you to create a grid in Adobe Illustrator. So, it's actually not very hard to create a grid and it's super helpful when you want to be precise in Adobe Illustrator. It's actually really, really helpful. And if you want to uh, add grid, um, you just go to view and then if you here you should see show grid, click on show grid. And now we can also go to edit preferences and um, guides and grid and here we can change the grid line every we can add let's say 45 and as you can see it changed and now a very important thing that you have to remember or you have to enable is to go here and enable a snap to grid this is going to help you a lot let's now i will zoom in and I'll uh, create a shape and as you can see it will snap so this is super important and I mean it's really helpful if you want to be precise in your work so if you want to be precise doing that can help you a lot because I'm not doing anything I'm not pressing any button to be precise if I just drag like this it's going to be precise automatically when I have a precise shape, so as I said, that's very helpful. So, so as you can see, by doing this now, even if I move a shape, it's going to snap to increments or snap to the grid. And as I said here, if you go to preference guides and grid, here I can customize this guides you can change the color i'll add some black and you can change this from lines to dots and here custom we can custom this as well from lines to dots you can change the subdivision now this is way bigger as you can see it's actually really huge but yeah make sure here you had guides and grid what number you prefer for pixels and now when you move as you can see that snaps just remember to enable snap to grid and from here let's change again guys here only to 3 and here to 23 now snaps really easily and it's super helpful alt to duplicate and i can just snap like this and it's really helpful because as you can see now it snaps Even if I'm changing only one uh, one single thing, like just a moving part of the image, sorry, part of a shape, I'm moving it snaps to a corner to increments. Even if now if I hold shift, also this helps to snap to increments. Now let's say select this don't have to hold shift because we have this enable but just so you know you can also hold shift and you can create really nice shapes if you want to be precise this is a great tool so I really hope you found this now I hope you learned something and now you are more familiar with Adobe Illustrator so you'll be able to create something nice in Adobe Illustrator because it's a really, really powerful software. You can create really nice graphic designs work. So if you have any additional questions, something that you'd like to know to learn about Adobe Illustrator, let me know in the comment section. I'll create a tutorial for you. Even if it's a really short tutorial, I'll create uh, that tutorial for you. So 
I really hope you found this helpful and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.